Imagine you're dating a woman for a few years yeah. and eventually break up. Okay. But then a year later, you receive a text from her, mm. and she is over the moon ecstatic. Oh. Wow, this is a dream for me, Jeff. Yeah. No, because for <laughs> you, it's the worst news possible. Oh. Uh oh. Whatever you're thinking is in that text message from her, I promise you, you're wrong. <laughs> it is the most uncomfortable and awkward situation to ever be in if you're this dude oh. who is oh. on the phone with us right now, begging oh. for help to get out out of it you're gonna hear the story in your brand new <laughs> awkward tuesday phone call right after this it's awkward it's tuesday it's awkward tuesday phone call we got an emergency email from a listener who Ooh. says he just went out on a great first date that was so good yeah. it actually got him into a little bit of trouble wait what and wait that's a good thing yeah well we're what? gonna talk to him about it here so we understand why and this is probably gonna sound kind of like a second date update but remember it's not okay so just keep that just because we say so yeah <laughs> and we are in charge of the rules here let's get okay. charlie up in here to talk to him about it charlie how you doing man uh, not too well, man. I'm oh, in a man. real rough situation. Did we call him or did he call us collect from somewhere? Uh -oh. <laughs> I don't know all the details, Charlie. Just tell us what happened. What went on with this date? I will say I would rather be locked up than have to go through what I'm going through right now. Oh, no. oh, that's even better. Okay, that now is... I think you're being dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> no, we need the tea. Uh, we got Give it. us the okay. tea, Charlie. Now, I did go on a great date recently with a woman, and it was amazing. I mean, it was just one of those dates where you don't want the night to end. That sounds oh, nice. Yeah. What's this lady's name? You know what? I would rather not tell you, and it'll oh. make sense when I get to the end. Uh -oh. Okay. It's getting real bad. This is kind of juicy, okay? To protect her? Oh, or my you? God. I feel like she stole something from you. No, 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 no. She didn't. Okay. It's, it's kind of my fault, and I'll, I'll explain. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh -oh. Tell us more. <laughs> It was late in the date. I mean, even though we both were tired, we were just walking around the city, and it had to be past midnight. We just kept talking. And oh, that's sweet. Yeah. yeah. It was nice. I mean, we ended up at her place, like right outside. Okay. I wasn't inside okay. or anything like that. I gave her a kiss goodnight, Aww. but I did not spend the night. Okay. Why? Look at you, great. gentlemen. Why? Jeff, because he's a gentleman and doesn't need yeah. to I'm surprised do Brooke is stuff. supportive of this. <laughs> that's true. Brooke would be like, oh, come on, give it to her. Scale the side of the building and get in there. <laughs> Oh my I mean, God. He didn't say she wasn't waiting in his closet. Yeah. In later. All right. But that's a, it's a very gentlemanly move. Yeah, yeah good work. That yeah. all sounds amazing. And it sounds like you planned on seeing this woman again. I, I do. I definitely oh, you like still her. Do. Okay. Still do. Okay. Absolutely. Um, mm. And speaking of being a gentleman, I don't know why I said this, but as I was walking away, I just turned around and I said, Hey, what's your favorite kind of flower? And she kind of just looks at me and she's like, roses, why? And I tell her, I'm going to send you the biggest bouquet of roses next week. Oh, that and is so whoa. cute. Her eyes got big and she seemed yes. really excited. Aww. How romantic. And I was happy about it too. I mean, come on. I was trying to do something nice for her. Yeah, it's the best what? to spoil So someone. you actually followed through? Yes, I went home immediately. I mean, I got right on my phone. It was like 2 o'clock in the morning, too, and I ordered a huge bouquet of roses. It was oh like 36 roses. Oh, my boy. Waste Damn. no time. Get Good right job. on that gift. You okay. liked this girl. Okay. I do. I do. I even put a little sappy message on it. I said, you have no idea how much I'm missing you right now. I'm oh. counting down the days until I can be with you again. Wait, was this wow. after our first date? After us, it was that good. Dang. That's a lot. That's None of a us lot, in this yeah. room have ever felt a love connection quite like that. And Brooke is married for 10 years. So. Hey. She's still hey. hoping for that feeling. We're all jealous. I felt that way. I just, it's a lot with roses. Wasn't after the first yeah. date, yeah. though. So you went online and ordered her roses at 2 in the morning. I and did. I, I'm not seeing what the problem is, though. Well, after I ordered the roses, it was late. I just went to bed. Yeah. But I do remember that it said when I ordered them that it'd be delivered in two days. Okay. So, okay. of course, on the second day, I wake up. I'm like waiting for a text, you know, to say, oh, my God, I love them. Just yes. waiting, waiting. Uh -huh. And then I start wondering, uh -oh. is she at work? And maybe she didn't see them. And then finally, at around six o'clock in the evening, I get a text. Oh. Not from her. Oh. From my ex. Oh, no. Saying, Charlie, you never cease to amaze and surprise no. me. Oh, You're the God. sweetest person ever. You sent them to your ex on accident? Uh. Yes. I must have oh. auto-filled it. Oh, and, my God. Yeah. Oh, 
it's not your first time using that website. Oh, <laughs> you <laughs> dummy. Oh. Clearly, yeah. flowers yeah. are a go-to move for Charlie. Yeah. Which is a sweet go-to yeah. move. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I think girls would be honored to be auto-saved in the yeah, set flowers. now your ex box. thinks you want to hook back up with her. The note said, you're the sweetest person ever. I've been missing you oh. like crazy. Oh, oh, my God. She thinks you're putting the vibe out to oh, reopen no. your love connection. Yes. And then she put on there, can we see each other Friday or if not sooner? Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah. She's oh. like back. Oh. <laughs> and you don't want to be with your ex? No, not at all. I mean, yeah. Just making sure it's not an option because maybe it's the only option yeah. you yeah. have now. A, Do you feel like maybe fate <laughs> intervened and that's no. the reason that her address went in there? <laughs> not one bit. I got nothing against her. We were still on good terms, but yeah. I, I know I like this new girl. But I just don't know what to do because when I got the oh. text, all I could do is just heart it and say, hey, I'll text you later and let you know. You, you hearted, hearted it? it? Well, you still made her day. Why did not you give that? it a thumbs up at least? Or the eyes wide emoji like, oops. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I panicked. I didn't know what to do. Oh, this is why God. it's good to have an Android phone. You don't. You can't even heart anything. Oh. I wish. <laughs> <laughs> now you do. Yeah, but you don't have a woman problem if you're using an Android <laughs> That's phone. True. That's how, true. Yeah, how long no ago women. did this happen? When was this? It was just the other day, and when it happened, I emailed you guys right away because I don't know what to do. Oh. It's going to be the most awkward conversation I've ever been in in my life. The flowers wasn't for her, and Yikes. when I, I'm gonna have to tell her, and I know she's gonna be hurt. And yes. I don't, I don't know what to say. I don't know how to do this. Oh my god. Okay, so you want us to call your ex here and let her know the truth oh, of what happened well, that night? He has yes. to tell her. All right. Well, this yes. is this is Jeez. yikes. That's all I can say. I'm understanding I the jail time thing now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I understand why you don't want to make this. I do have to ask though. What about that girl that you went on the great date with? Well, okay. Good news of that. I did reorder her 36 <laughs> roses. I even texted her and let her know there was a problem with the delivery, but these will be there soon. Oh, oh good okay. news. Okay. So she's still on her mind. You didn't say what the problem was. <laughs> it's a no. smart no. man. Good. All right. Yeah. Well, we're going to try and come back and give you some smart advice Yikes. when yeah. we let you make your awkward Tuesday phone call to your ex-girlfriend saying, I didn't oh. really mean to send a bouquet of romantic Sad. flowers to you. Oh, Those man. were for my new girl. Sad. We're going to do it coming up right after this. Hold on, man. It's awkward. It's Tuesday. It's awkward Tuesday phone call. We got a text at 78592 from a listener named Sam who says, man, this guy's completely screwed. <laughs> I wouldn't know what to do either. I'd probably just go out with her for a few weeks and then break up again. Oh, hey. That sounds easier than Don't making this phone call. Start a fake relationship no, with her. No, that's even more mean. <laughs> if you missed is. it, this really is one of the most awkward situations that we've had on our show in a while. Yeah. Our listener Charlie emailed us for help because he had an amazing date with a woman the other yes. night. He went home right afterwards and at 2 in the morning, while exhausted and still high on love, Ugh. ordered three dozen roses to send to her. Yeah. Only to find out a couple days later, the website auto-filled the delivery address to his ex-girlfriend instead. Oh, darn it. The ex got the bouquet and was thrilled, yeah. thinking, oh my stars, uh. he wants me back. <laughs> Yes, Aww. which needless to say puts Charlie in a oh. tough spot. So now we need to give him some advice on what to say to let his ex down easy in your awkward Tuesday phone call. Yikes. Brooke, I would love to hear your advice for okay, Charlie. Okay, here's my idea. Does your ex have a buddy of yours that she already hates? Hmm. That who hates? That she hates, yeah every, yeah. every girlfriend has someone they hate that their boyfriend's <laughs> friends with. Yeah, yeah. True. Okay, we're going to blame it on that guy. What you're going to do is you're going to tell her that your dumb buddy was drunk and thought it would be a funny prank to send her flowers with your oh. name, mm. right? And you're so embarrassed. It wasn't funny. You're so sorry. That's good. What do you think? Make one of your buddies take uh, the bullet for you? It, it kind of feels like I'm... Um, being slimy if you, I do that. Yeah, you're already being slimy. You should, no, what is, he's not. no, no, I'm not. It was an honest mistake. What, it was an accident, Brooke. What's better than telling her that you meant to send those to somebody else? Oh, yeah, that hurts. Uh, hey. yeah. Jose, what no, do you think? My advice is to tell her you meant to send it to somebody else. No! <laughs> think about it. Look, nothing Ouch. is worse than false Ouch. hope and embarrassment. So you want to be honest? She's your ex? No. You just say, look, Bottom of my heart, I'm glad I made your day. I'm glad I made you smile. But those were honestly not for you, and I'm oh, so sorry. God, that hurts. That hurts worse than the breakup. How do you feel about brutal honesty, Charlie? 
you know what? After hearing that, let's go back to that first option. Yeah. <laughs> I told you. Okay. Oh, I thought Not I was a responsible fan. I told you. Well, yeah. No matter what way you decide to go with this, <laughs> we're going to be on the call with you. If you need a little bit of help, a little bit of support, I'm going to mm. dial your ex-girlfriend, though, Kendra, right now. Oh, my God. Oh. Good luck, okay? Oh, you got Kendra this, dude. Oh, Kendra is her name. I never even think we heard that. Okay. Here we go. Hello? Hey, Kendra. Hey. <laughs> Wait, Charlie? Oh. Yeah. Oh, my God. You are so sweet. I just got the second bouquet of flowers you sent. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What? What did you say? Oh. Say that again? You're a persistent little sugar bear, aren't you? Oh. <laughs> I, I sent you... Yeah, two bouquets of roses? I can't believe you're spoiling me like this. Where is this coming from? Mm. Um, I, I, re- I really don't know. Uh, my heart, I guess. Oh my god, I can't wait to see you and kiss you. Uh, I'm going to give you a special thank you for those flowers. Oh, oh re- really? Uh, can I see you on Friday, maybe? Friday? Um, oh. Yeah. I, I'm not sh- I want to oh, see you as soon as I can. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I want to see you, too. But here's the thing. Mm. Um, my work is sending me away. Like, I'm going to Ecuador. <laughs> whoa, 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 what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Yeah, I'm I'm going away for like three, maybe nine months. I mean, nine. what? You work at a grocery store? I thought. Yeah, I do, I do, but we're expanding. That's why I'm going. Oh. They're expanding to Ecuador. Yeah, yeah, it's this whole thing. Um, oh. and to Argentina, um, Madagascar, and, and you know all the southern places. No. So you know. <laughs> Oh, my God. Yeah, I- I'm so sorry. I mean, I'm not going to be around for a while, as you can, you know, you, you can tell. I mean, and the flowers, they were kind of like a-, a little farewell, you know, a-, a way for me to say, you'll always be in my heart. Oh, oh well, that that breaks my heart. What? Oh. I know, I know. But, hey, I, I don't know what to say oh. other than, you know, Ari Verderci. <laughs> oh my god. Ari Verdurchi, huh? How did this get oh worse? Gosh. It got worse, that's oh. for sure. Hey, Kendra. What was that noise? Hi, Kendra. Hey, that noise is a whole radio show jumping in on the call because you're on the radio right now with Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. Hey. It's a going away party. Uh, what? Yeah. A going away party. Um, <laughs> what is going on? Yeah. Exactly. Uh, I don't know quite how to explain it to you, so maybe mm. I'm just going to let Charlie yeah, take the lead smart. here. Charlie, why don't you, yeah. why don't you tell He's Kendra what's happening? such a good job already. <laughs> um, I, I told her um, I'm going away, uh-huh. and I, I just wanted to let you know that, you you know, you're a good person, and I just, I'll, I'll, you'll always be in my heart. Okay. Yeah. And, and the reason that we're on the call yeah, is because he it was a tough thing to say to you about oh. how special you were to him. So he wanted some moral support. And that, that's what we're he's doing. He's happy for what was. Oh. Yeah. And it won't be anymore. But I don't know if you can tell. He's in deep, deep pain. Just the thought of leaving you. Okay. Going yeah. all the way to Ecuador. Let's not do all I mean, that. Charlie, Charlie, I would wait for you. No, no. No. Oh, that's no, 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 no. Don't ever wait for a man, Kendra. No. Don't ever wait for a man. <laughs> it, it would be selfish for me to ask you to do that. I, I can't do that's that. That's right. Oh. Yep. yep, that's that right. That must have hurt to say. After all this, are you kidding? People told me you'd never change and that you'd always be selfish, nope. but this, this shows them. <laughs> nope, I think the other people were right, Kendra. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, yep, I've changed. I mean, Well, you've listen, changed. I have. I mean, there's no real way to stay in touch either because, you know, on this trip, it's such a big deal. They're taking my, my cell phone. Oh. Yeah. It's, oh. like, wow. it's like if Survivor were to do grocery stores. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. They're taking your phone? Yeah. yeah. How see, can they do that? The thing, 
Well, because it's, it's business and they yeah. really want me to focus mm-hmm. on my job and this expansion. Yeah. So mm-hmm. it might look like I'm ignoring you or blocking you, but that's not the case. I'm just, you know, working. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Plus the international that fees is... are all right. wild. And We're yeah. really sorry about that, Ken Joe. We, we all feel really bad about it. So I think he's yeah. saying don't, don't wait for him. I mean, I'm well, more sorry than you know. Yeah. Well, can I can I write to you at least? Like, no. are you going to have an address? I think this is going to be too painful, Kendra. I think you should just move on. Yeah. I think you should move on. I don't know if yeah. Charlie would be okay with that. I think, Charlie, he, would, yeah, Jeffrey, I think he would be fine with it. I, I want her to be happy. I, I want <laughs> wow. you to find happiness. But dude, is happy that's, being with him? That's really big of you, dude. No. Okay. But he loves me and he misses me. Oh, I know it hurts. Well, maybe. <sighs> did the note say love? I don't know if it did. Yeah. <laughs> Charlie, you love me, right? Oh. Oh. There is love in my heart. That's <laughs> <laughs> such a good answer. It's one of those. Where- Carly, I love you too. Oh my god, this oh feels bad. God. This feels real wow. bad, Jeff. Well, I don't know. It, it feels kind of warm inside. No, now. no. I, this you is know, awful. Well, this is the farewell. Yeah, goodbye, Charlie. Is there anything that you want to say to him before he goes to Ecuador and changes the world? Charlie, just the flowers and you doing this radio thing. I mean, like that, that's so thoughtful and special. I, no. I think I really do love he you. He's a very, very wow. thoughtful man, very yes. detail-oriented. Is he? Because he said yeah. arrivederci and he's moving to a Spanish-speaking oh, country. Yeah. He's working on <laughs> it, bro. I don't know how detail-oriented Charlie is. Yeah. Yeah. Like, he's going to get one of those language apps and he's going to come back uh, in three yeah. to nine months a totally changed man. Wow. Maybe yeah. years. Don't wait for him. Yeah. <laughs> we wish you all the best, okay, Kendra? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, bye. Yeah, he's dead to you. Just move on. <laughs> <laughs> Arifa Darchi, as they would say in Ecuador. <laughs> or Nebraska. <Yeah. laughs>